Time for Keith Cruz and Matilda Eckholm. First. Not just on her feet, but on her shot making as well. And Matilda loves to slow the game down. Um, taking that two out of three game win over Deborah Vivarelli. The way she won it, she was down 10 7, yep. catching an edge there. To play in a really unsettling way for Keith. If she plays at a quick pace, we could see some uh, some discomfort from, uh, from Cruz. Cruz gets on the board, it's 4-1. to one. I thought it was really interesting, Matt, when we talked to Monty Eckholm after her match yesterday. And she talked about the training she had done to build herself back up, to get ready for singles, and you know, how she feels like she's getting there. She's not there yet. Uh, it's difficult to address that question because she's never going to be playing the same number of hours that she was when she was in her prime. Um, so, I mean, she's a coaching director, part of Pingpot. Um, so, she really has to focus before and she can play five hours a week now. How do you use that five hours of time to get the most out of it? Ooh. Oh, that's vicious from Keith There was. She's back within two, trailing 6-4. You know, she might be small, but when she hits that ball on the forehand, we saw her hit a kind of fly swat haymaker before. Yeah, but I, I mean, huge props to Matilda. I mean, if you compare her level now to... And yeah, she's, she's definitely playing much, much better. And as she said, much closer to her old level. Cruz serving, trailing 8-5. 2 1 win over Debbie Vivarelli yesterday. Matt is leading 9 6. Still have Taiyun Kim and Sing Wan Lee to come in fourth singles before the Golden Game. At home. Cruz was patient. Yeah. Then match is going to be a huge challenge for Matilda. Can <laughs> Eckholm wants to end the points more quickly? Comfortable way, then it might take some of that advantage away. Oh, what a return with the backhand from the young Filipino Cruz. It's Ten serving nine. Echo claims game one. Yeah, unfortunately, a lot of these uh, women's players and some of the men as well fall into the trap of not having the confidence to try and flick or to drop short against the reverse and they just push long and that's exactly what Matilda's waiting for. Interested to see if Tim Wong uses the timeout here if Cruz falls behind in game two. And Kim versus Sengwon mm -hmm. Lee coming up, and then he probably wants to save one for the Golden Game. But one, the way Ekholm looks tonight. 3-1 lead here. Three, Finally got to compete in the Olympics, but it's complicated. The country did not endorse her entry wow. into the Olympics. This point, we might see a Florida timeout. Correct home. Giving away two free points off your serve. Oh, he's yeah. still showing some really good cool match. Guo took two out of three from Matilda. Oh, she's just made the. Five. Wow, 
Why is there a WTC event in Kosovo? Oh, that caught the edge for Matilda. And she re Drew's making a good decision here. Oh, you <laughs> kidding me? <laughs> Come on. 8-7 at home. 8-8. Eight, eight. I mean, no time violation warning issued. Missed by Ekholm. Cruz inches within one. And all here in game two. Second. Two golden points yesterday against Debbie Vivarelli and split them. Game two goes to Cruz. He placed it down hard. It didn't bounce <laughs> at all. Ekholm yeah, cannot afford to get back to table by someone slamming their paddle down like that. I like the clock's ticking down and she's not. She throws her paddle again. That that's definitely a card. And that's a red. And that she might have been ready to serve, but Keith wasn't ready to receive yet. And Hang time on the net with that one. Executive points. Dating back to game two. Eight in a row now. She really did. Keith Cruz in total control right now, though. Ten in a row. Who saw this coming? Like Keith Cruz was down and out, about to be two games to none down. Finally, Ekholm snaps the string. Ten. Oh, to get back to that <laughs> playing against the. Cruz snaps the small hitters. A little bit over the side from that home, but the right shot selection. Keith Cruz. Now she's got seven points to win the match. Five, ten. Ekholm erases one. Ten, six. Oh, look at that. <laughs> Wild match this has been. Still match point for Cruz. Four straight for Ekholm. And contend. My goodness. Ekholm wanted to throw the paddle again, but thought better of it. The surface error to close it out. That match was a roller coaster in so many ways. And Cruz able to prevail.